Hi, welcome to today's Talk of the Town. I'm Sandy Benson, here to introduce the grand opening of Daybreak Adult Care Services to the Low Country. Linda Lee, owner, shares how their services provide personal care in the privacy and security of their own home. Linda Lee, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me. So tell us about your caregivers <laughs> and how you select them per, per client. They, uh, we have the best caregivers. It's, they're really the heart and soul of our business. Um, what we do is we go through a very intense screening process. So they have the background checks, they have the drug tests, um, they're certified and licensed and bonded. And so we make sure that we go through the, uh, the quality checks of that. But then they all have each expertise levels and so we right. make sure that we match that up with the client. So if a client has a condition like Alzheimer's or Parkinson's or you know other conditions like that we make sure that it's an expertise level that matches. And it, there's there's certain um, qualifications to match those up, correct? I Absolutely. mean, they, usually yeah. they take special classes, they have cer certain certifications yep. that will allow them to actually help that client. Absolutely. And we have continuous training as well, so we make sure that they keep their knowledge up to par and updated. Um, kind of continuous education program. Absolutely, programs. absolutely. And you know, each condition has its different quirks. So, right. you know, for instance, Parkinson's patients, they can't miss their medication. You know, sure. Certain examples like that, that um, unless you have that experience and expertise, you just wouldn't know those kind of things. Right. So, do you have set hours um, and and or cost structures, or is that all varied? It, it does vary, but we, we're available seven days a week, 24 hours a day, um, every day of the year, so we're, we're around the clock. Mm -hmm. um, cost structures vary, so we can do hourly as well as respite care, which basically means that we relieve the existing primary uh, family caregiver. Um, or we could do live-in services, so that's 24-hour service where the caregiver actually lives with the family. Okay, and so uh, can you handle special needs patients or do you know, I guess that goes back to the, the having the specialty certifications or qualifications, yeah. right? Yeah, we, yeah we, we definitely can handle the special needs and then not only do we do the in-home service, but we do facilities as well. So we do hospice and home care. And okay, nurse, and I was going to ask yeah. you that because I know that um, you know in-home service is 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 wonderful, yeah. especially for you know the elderly or people that just don't want to leave their surroundings that they're comfortable with. But right. they there are situations where they may be in a different type of facility. So you will go to those facilities. Yeah, and those organizations are wonderful. But we you know we all know that they don't get that personal attention that they really need sometimes and so the one-on-one -on -one care is just invaluable even in a facility and so we will send people out there as well. Sure. So um, what is your process for evaluating say a case? Well, so um, we definitely do a home assessment first so we evaluate the client, make sure that we understand their needs. Um, we, we, go, we go out of our way to make sure that we understand the whole environment, so not just the condition that they're in, but the different interests that they have, what little things we can do to keep their spirits up, um, the environment, the geography, um, all, those kind of, all those factors come into play. And then uh, when we find a caregiver that matches that, we, uh, we evaluate it then. And so um, when you look at the type of care that um, Daybreak gives, so what is different from, say, your competitors? Well, we, uh, we certainly pamper our clients. So we, um, we make sure that not only the basic medical and clinical needs are met, but you know, those bulleted list of mechanical tasks right. are kind of a bare minimum for us. We go out of our way to make sure their spirits are up and um, whatever interests they had when they were younger, essentially just making them feel less like a patient. And you work um, hand in hand with the physicians or, and or uh, uh, an outside nursing staff and or either the facility or hospital, correct? Definitely, definitely. We, um, we work with the physicians. So you to coordinate make those efforts. Yes, yes. We put together a very unique and detailed uh, care plan for each client. And we do have nurses on staff, so they help with the assessment initially. Uh, we also do drop-in visits to make sure the quality of care is consistent right. and that it's continuous and we don't miss a beat. Um, and so we've been very lucky with the caliber of talent that have come through our doors uh, to help with this process. Absolutely. Yeah. So, Linda, people that are interested in the services that you provide or, or just in contacting or maybe just have questions, how do they get a hold of you? Well, they can go to our website, um, daybreakcare.com, or they can call our main number at 843-415-3211. Wonderful. Linda, thank you so much. Thank you. And we will be right back with Talk of the Town.